Another example is this one. Remember before I said this mid-detail is, is something that doesn't exist inside Final Cut and Premiere. If we look at her face, she's a very attractive woman, but she's clearly not 20. And we'd like to make her a little either older or younger. If I grab mid-detail and drag it to the right, it accentuates all of the skin imperfections and turns her into a, an older woman and she will never talk to me again. But if I go the other way, notice now I can smooth her out and youth her a bit. Now, granted, I could take her all the way to plastic and even Barbie would not recognize her. I don't want to get that carried away, but I want to, for sure, take out some of the stress of those wrinkles by just adding a little bit of the uh, decreasing the detail in the midtones, which I like a lot. It's not zero setting is normal, and I want to set it to maybe like mm, 25 or 30 percent where it's smoother, but it's not looking ridiculous. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar, taking a look at the color page inside DaVinci Resolve 19. For the complete version of this online training, please visit my store at LarryJordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 374. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's almost 2,000 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.